Hi everyone, Mike here from Player One Ready, doing another FIFA 18 Team of Season review. This time it is of uh, Inter Milan striker Mauro Icardi. So, played seven games with him, scored 12 goals and three assists, so just under two goals a game. Uh, could have done better, but um, wasn't playing particularly well with this team, but he was a shining, shining light. Um, so, yeah, he was. Uh, I bought him for 213k, but this is FIFA, I'm recording this on the night of the FIFA 18 um, World Cup being announced. Or being released, so he's got down to about 100k. So bargain if you can get him, I'd happily do so. Now to avoid it, you see my record. There's a picture of Colo Torre in there. I'm ashamed of my record, so Colo will do. So the big man, Mario Cardi, has got 86 acceleration, 92 sprint speed, 99 positioning, 99 finishing, 94 shot power, and 81 long shots, 94 volleys, 91 penalties, 81 vision, 93 short passing, uh, 88 agility, 91 balance, 99 reactions. Uh, 92 ball control, 88 dribbling, 98 composure, 99 heading, 99 jumping, 85 stamina and 89 strength. So we're going to go to two things. I, I'm missing an assist for some reason clip. So I'll show you two assists and his all his goals. So um, didn't, didn't score any headers with him, didn't really try to. Um, but we're just going to break down to he's just his, his finishing. Uh, left foot, right foot, doesn't really matter. He's going to score anyway, 99 finishing. Um, as you'd expect, really buried everything. But what I was really impressed with in this stat was his his movement. It was it was absolutely outstanding. Now I know he's got nine line positioning, um, but it was better. Batch wise got nine line positioning, and Icardi's um, movement was just better. It just was. He made runs off defenders really really well. Um, always found him like found space to to get a shot away from goal, and when he was there, obviously he was going to finish it. So uh, kudos to him. I was really impressed with that. Actually, I was probably more impressed with that than his actual finishing, and his finishing was clinical. So that that speaks volumes for me. Um, again, here is movement. You might, if you've watched um, the Luis Alberto Ilicic review comparison, you've probably seen all the, a lot of these goals before. But um, for those of you who haven't, then you're in for a treat because these guys, these goals are really good finishes, and the way he runs off defenders and runs off centre halves was was phenomenal. Um, now he's actually fairly quick as well. He's got decent pace. Um, He's got really good strength, really good uh, agility and balance. So it's it, it's a more, it's a more all-round card that you'd expect from from a normal Mara Riccardi. Usually he's just a finisher, but he created um, not created, but he was good at holding up play and bringing others into play, allowing him to make runs off defenders and getting into better goal-scoring opportunities. So don't overlook that sh that that short passing upgrade because it does help him. Um, make sort of chances for himself by being able to like feed other players through and then being able to run off run off the, into their passes so do not underestimate that at all going in here this is a really nice run just off just pulling wide a little bit just to find that actually out of space and when he's there he's going to thump that home no questions asked i say because of the world cup uh game mode being added he's now available as i said for probably about 100k so you know you want a, a player of this caliber get him now really do because he's um He's an incredible, incredible striker, and his movement will will be better than most strikers you'll you'll have used on this FIFA, even if they share the same rating. He's just better. Um, again, here he's just peeling, just uh, doesn't have to doesn't even run there. He just holds his he just holds his position, and the defender has to run and find a better space to clear a ball when he's there to there to slide at home again. Just to run down the middle, then his 99 finishing will just thump that home again. Where you drill it, or whether you finesse it, whether you do the low shot or a, or a blast towards the corner, he's going to score. So it doesn't really matter what you do, it's in, and he's got like high volleying stat and a decent long long shot now as well with 81. So a more all-round striker than you'd expect from from Icardi. Here is two assists. Again, it's not not really sure why I'm explaining these to you, but again, just a, just a nice little short pass past the Virgil Van Dijk. It looks like, and I made a mess of that with Alberto, but it's in. And again, just a simple, just a simple pass around the corner, goes past Ramos and slots it home. So, going into a final uh, final screen, I'm going to give him um, five star. He, he, he was slim, and the, the price I was going to give him five star value for coins anyway when he was 200k, but now he's 100k. Definitely get him. Uh, you, you you have no reason to. Other cards he's like or, or similar pricing and fairly similar to Lewandowski and Kane's on forms because they're just out and out finishers and Rodrigo's just out and out finisher as well so you know they're, they're all similarly priced if you fancy those as an alternative to Icardi or if you can't afford him well you can't afford him but you can't put him in your team but you want someone like him then those are the players for you if you really like if you enjoyed this review um, then please subscribe to the channel it means a lot to all of us and uh, I'll show you around for more FIFA 18 videos